Do you ever feel like you have a million ideas floating around in your head for your creative content, only to struggle to create and stay consistent when it comes to publishing your content? Or maybe you have a goal in mind to create a new sales funnel, but you can't quite figure out how to make time to make it a reality. How about using a vision board? I'm guessing as an entrepreneur in the online space, you've created a vision board at some point to help you clarify your goals, visualize your dreams, and ultimately manifest the life you want. Am I right? What if you create a vision board in Canva for your desktop to achieve content consistency. Today, I'll share some tips and tricks for designing a vision board that will inspire and motivate you to take action. Whether you're looking to boost your creativity, create content consistently, or simply have fun designing a visual representation of your goals, I invite you to listen in today to discover how you can maximize your creativity and create a vision board that truly works for you. Oh my goodness, do you wanna know one of the best ways that you can help me? I would love for you to either rate or review this show so other business owners just like you can benefit from this podcast. Thank you, friend, I really appreciate it. Hey, online business owner, welcome to the Content Systems for Growth with me, Michelle Dewey. Are you ready to let go of guilt, stress, and missed deadlines? Are you struggling to keep up with the demands of running a household, taking care of your family, and creating consistent organic content? Well, you're not alone. Juggling all the to-dos of being a mom and owning an online business can be challenging. But here's the good news. By implementing effective content systems and organization strategies, you can streamline your workflow, increase your productivity, and find Finally, take control of your schedule. Each week, I'll explore content management systems and mindset hacks to help you rediscover your creativity, passion, and enjoyment in content creating. If you're ready to save time with systemized content marketing strategies and productivity tips, then go refill your coffee mug, pop in those earbuds, and let's tackle that pile of laundry. It's time to reclaim your time and energy while you take your business to the next level. Let's grow, friends. Are you wondering how you can create a vision board that will actually keep you consistent with your content? There are many benefits of using a vision board for your goal setting and creating content consistently is just one of those goals that I'm sure you're working to achieve in your business. A vision board visually represents your goals, dreams, and aspirations. It's a powerful tool to help you clarify your goals and visualize your future. When you create a vision board, you're able to see your goals tangibly and visibly, which can be incredibly motivating. When you look at your vision board daily, you're reminded of what you're working towards. This can help you stay focused and motivated even when you encounter obstacles or those setbacks that are unexpected. A vision board is a perfect solution to overcome your content inconsistencies or any other struggles you're attempting to overcome in your business. That's why I create a monthly vision board on Canva for my desktop computer. Everything I'm working towards along with a visual reminder of why I'm working to achieve it. Just in case you're unfamiliar with Canva, here are four quick steps in order to get you started. Canva is a free online graphic design tool that makes it so easy to create stunning visual content for your business. With Canva, you can create everything from your social media graphics to presentations to your ideal clients to vision boards. Here are the four basic things that you'll want to know to get started with Canva when you need to create an account. So Canva is free. You can sign up for a free account. You can use your email address, Facebook, or Google. It doesn't matter. But if you don't have an account now, go ahead and sign up for free. Number two, you need to choose a template. Once you've actually created your account, you're just gonna choose a template to get started. And Canva has a wide range of templates to choose from to create a vision board. And this is so easy because all you need to do is type in that search bar that comes up on the main screen vision board desktop wallpaper. Number three is you're gonna customize that design. So after you choose a template, and really it doesn't matter because you can switch in and out your templates when you're in there designing, 
You can customize your design by adding images, text, and other elements. As I mentioned before, I create a new one each month with my current goals and projects that I'm working towards in my business. Yes, once upon a time, I had the goal of creating consistent content for my blog. It was a struggle. And number four, you want to save and download that design. Once you've finished designing your vision board, you can download that image and set it as your desktop background. You'll see it all the time as you're sitting at your desk working in and on your business. And that's why I'd love to have it on my desktop. So it keeps me motivated and focused on my goals. Here are some tips on how to create a vision board on Canva. Now that you understand the basics of Canva, let's dive into some tips and tricks for actually designing an effective vision board. Here are some things to keep in mind. Number one, I want you to choose the right images and font for your vision board. When you're designing your vision board, it's important to choose images and fonts that resonate with you, friend. You want your vision board to reflect your unique personality and style. So don't be afraid to choose images and fonts that actually speak to you. Personally, I use my brand fonts and colors because I love them that much. Two, add the current month's calendar. While you do not need to do this, I'd like to put a calendar of the current month. That way I know this is the one thing I'm working towards in this current month. If it is your quarterly goal, add all three of the months to keep you focused to achieve that goal during that quarter. Or if you're a fan of the 12 week year, same thing. The easiest way to do this is to search for your current month and year when you're in the design from the left sidebar menu. I find a calendar that I like, I add it as a separate page, then I group that calendar element together. You may need to delete any of the background pieces that are in there so you don't get more than you want in your grouping. And then just simply move that up to your current design for your background. I hope that's not too confusing, but I found that to be way easier than actually trying to put my con or trying to put together a calendar in there myself. Number three, adding motivational quotes and affirmations is tip number three. In addition to your images and your fonts, you can also add motivational quotes and affirmations to your vision board. These can be powerful reminders of what you're working towards and can help keep you motivated and focused. I know the one for me personally is you're only hurting yourself. This is my constant reminder that I hear in my head when I don't want to do something. Tip four, organizing your vision board for maximum impact is number four. So when you're designing your vision board, it's important to think about how you want to organize it. Generally, I choose a template that actually speaks to me and go with it. But you do you. Arrange it in a way that feels visually appealing to you and motivating. There is a magic in the power of visualizing your goals. Designing a vision board on Canva is a powerful tool for clarifying your goals, visualizing your dreams, and ultimately manifesting the life you want. Okay, friend, it's time to wrap this up. Creating a vision board is a powerful tool that clarifies your goals and aspirations, keeps you motivated, and helps you achieve the life and business that you have been working towards. When you choose the right images and font, you add those motivational quotes and affirmations, and you organize your vision board to speak to you, it provides you that maximum impact and you can create a vision board that truly works for you. Why not give it a try? Create your own vision board on Canva today and start visualizing that life of your dreams. So go ahead and grab your laptop and get started today. Okay, maybe not today. Instead, schedule time on your calendar to get it done. Better yet, set it up as a reoccurring monthly action item so you never forget to do it again. Thank you, friends, so much for listening. I appreciate you and I hope you have. 
Yay. Thank you so much for listening. I hope that you found this episode valuable and learned some actionable tips that you can implement in your business so that you can feel accomplished and less stressed. If you enjoyed this show, please take a quick minute to share this with your business bestie, subscribe, and leave a review. It helps me reach more business owners just like you. And if you have any questions or topics you'd like me to cover in future episodes, please reach out to me on my website. I've created a form just for you. Remember, with the right system and mindset, you can achieve the success your heart desires. Thank you for tuning in. I look forward to chatting with you next time. I appreciate you and I hope you have a wonderful week. And don't forget, let's grow friends. Thank you.